so we need to do a little bit of an intervention in the front garden because I didn't put enough soil and compost in these beds to really support the corn as they grow. So we just bought some garden soil and we're gonna, well, I'm gonna top it up, not one. <laughs> I'm gonna top it up and give them a little bit better footing. And as you can see, they're still growing pretty freaking good anyway. But hey, a little bit of help here and there never hurts. Uh, we'll see you in a bit. Well, I guess before I actually put the soil in the beds here, I gotta like uh, weed them because I got tomatoes growing in here again. My compost is full of tomato seeds. Oh, well, you know, you live and learn. So after I finish weeding, then I'll fill these in with some extra soil. That's one garden bed done. Hopefully the corn will appreciate it. Now we move on to bed number two. I already weeded that one. So I'll just top it up with some more soil. Give them a water later on today when it's not so humid. And uh, go to the back because I got plans for the backyard too where the pumpkins are growing. Finish the beds. A lot more soil in them now. They're almost to the top of the wood. Just gives the corn a bit of a more structure, I guess, because as you can see, the wind, even though it doesn't blow this way, it blows this way towards the neighbor's house, and they're starting to fall over. Although they are growing very well, I think they should have a bit more, you know, stuff to keep them in place. What do you think, Henry? What do, the, do you like how the garden beds look? Henry's a man of few words. So anyway, I'm going to uh, finish watering these plants right now. And then I have another little project in the backyard. We, there's a space where I'm growing my pumpkins this year that I call it a fluid space. Um, but I'm gonna be laying some wood chips down in it because we're not gonna let the grass grow there. It'll be like another section of garden for me to, to do what I want with it. So anyway, I'll be showing that to you soon enough. But thanks for hanging out with me here. Ciao for now.